arena and look at how fast he's racing through the area with all that energy from Hurricane Ian. Radar estimated totals for the past six hours People there. Getting, like, also between up about half an inch for those inland zones, but look at how heavy they get as you approach the coast of Charlotte County, close to about the two-inch range. Winds have really been picking up as we start to now see Hurricane Ian get a bit closer to parallel to the Collier County coast, where we've seen our last reported gusts of 66 miles per hour in Marco Island. 60 mile per hour wind gusts in Naples. We've seen some wind gusts in the fi about the 50 to 60 range. Cape Coral, Sanibel, these decreases you head inland. A look at our forecast wind gusts this is what we could see here as we head in. And as you heard that wonderful, wonderful woman, and yes, I've been coloring just to keep myself kind of calm. And this is what I've been doing. Um, just, we're in the, I live in Southwest Florida, so, without saying much, there are no streams for the remainder of this week. I'm gonna post this, uh, uh video on my Discord, as well as up on the wonderful channel you're watching it on now, which is probably YouTube. Um, letting everybody know that there will not be streams this week. And it's because of the weather now. Will there be, like, little snippet videos on the YouTube channel? More than likely. Um, if you want to keep up with me, please go to my website. Um, and you can find all my social media links there. Um, but... I will also be posting, like, little tiny live videos on uh, Facebook as I can because we only have two backup batteries and then whatever's charged on my laptop once the power goes out. I love you guys. I will see you on the other side. This is going to get nasty and scary. Um, I'll, I'll talk to you soon. I'll let you guys know when I'm going to be back. Alright. Be safe. Love your neighbor. Alright, later.